Hi, this is Gino with Music Villa, and today Gino likes the Roland RT Mic S. Uh, I don't know what to say about this. This is not a new product. It's something that had slipped by um, my radar, and when I found out what it was, I instantly was like, we need to have these in the store. So for all practical applications, I'm going to call this a snare drum microphone. There is a microphone right here. You can kind of see the little, little uh, air holes so it can... It can hear the drum itself, but it's, what's really, really neat about the RT Mic S is this is a snare drum trigger, and it also has sounds inside it, and you can also load up to eight of your own samples into this. So what's really, really cool is they, they loaded this up with, let's see, two different snare drum sounds, two different claps, a couple different percussions, and some, a couple of special effects. So it's really, really simple to use. Basically, you just put it right on the drum, and then you tighten it down, and the sensor here is, uh, of course, that's Roland's great drum trigger sensor. Works wonderfully. It's right here, touches the head. There's a sensitivity knob on one side, but the way this is really set up is when you're when you're playing, all the controls are on your left side here, left side of the microphone. So you can actually, you have you have an output for just the microphone or a blend for the electronics and you can there's a switch to decide if you want all electronics going to the board or you want to mix it here. Um, you also have volume for both of those things and just the power switch and then the USB output. So it's an extremely simple interface. It's a great way to add you know just a little bit of beef. I mean something like a hand clap or a tamp. There's tambourines in here. Wonderful. There's also that nice fat um, I mean, I'm going to call it an Al Green snare drum, you know, that big thing that almost sounds like a tom-tom. A lot of, a lot of uh, tunes have that kind of sound. It's a nice thing to be able to add without switching your drum out or throwing, you know, a towel on the drum or something. That's the, that's the old way I used to do it. This thing, you just uh, flick the switch and you're good to go. So come on in and, and listen to this. It's fantastic.